What's going on, y'all? I am back on the Madden 15 Ultimate Team, bringing you the cheap budget squad players on offense. Starting things out with a quarterback, Ryan Fitzpatrick from the Texans, six foot two, 81 throw power, 85 throw accuracy short, 81 play action, 86 throw accuracy deep. He goes for cheap, man. Here we go, Sam Bradford, six foot four, 94 throw accuracy short, 92 play action, 83 throw accuracy deep, and 89 throw power. Pretty good budget squad quarterback. Goes for around 6K. I mean, his price may drop and might fluctuate around the 5K barrier. So go ahead and keep an eye on him. Pick him up if you need him. Now moving on to the halfbacks. We have Pierre Thomas from the Saints. 88 speed, 87 agility, 90 carrying, 86 truck, and 88 acceleration. Man, he, the guy has a pretty solid card, man. Goes for around 2K. He's, a lot, he's worth a lot more than that, if you ask me. Now we have Giovanni Bernard, the speedster from Cincinnati. 5'8". 90 speed, 95 agility, 95 acceleration, 90 elusiveness, 93 ball carry vision. Man, I can't wait to see if he gets an elite card or, you know, a golden ticket because this card is one of the best halfbacks in the game. Now we have Danny Woodhead. He starts on my team as of right now. 5'8", 90 speed, 94 acceleration. <sighs> a lot of 90s, man. 91 elusiveness, 94 ball carry vision, 94 agility, 88 carrying. And you can see why I started, man. He does it all. He can be a receiver. He can be a running back. Great in screens. Great out of the backfield. He does it all, man. Now on to the fullbacks. We have Anthony Sherman from the Chiefs. Great run blocker right here at an 89. He's one of the best run blocking fullbacks in the game. Goes for around 6K as of right now. If you can get him for cheaper, that would be a great addition to your squad. So be on the lookout for him. And add him to your arsenal if you need him. Moving on to the wide receivers, we're going to Miami for this one. We got Brian Hartline. Look at the size on him, man. Six foot tall. It's actually 6'2, 86 speed, 87 awareness, 85 spec catch, a 90 catch in traffic, 89 catch, man. Just above average for what he's going for. Around 3K. You should go ahead and scoop him up right now, man. I'm telling you. So now we're going to Philly for this one. We got Jeremy Macklin coming off an injury. Look at these stats, 90 speed and 88 elusiveness, 84 catching, and, you know, 78 catching traffic, 84 spec catch, nothing too, you know, standing out. But at the same time, he's still an all around great card to have for around 5K. Now to the tight ends, we got Dennis Pitta from the Baltimore Ravens, six foot four. You're gonna use him as a pass catcher, uh, tight end, a pass catching tight end because, you know, he's not the best run blocker, but at the same time, he's a pretty good receiver at, at the tight end position. Goes for around six, 5K. You should go ahead and look at what he's going for. Pick him up if you need a tight end. 89 catching traffic, 91 catching, 84 awareness, all above average. Now to the lineman, we have a left tackle, Jared Valdir. Excuse me if I'm getting that wrong, but look at the size on the man. 94 strength, 92 pass blocking, 82 run blocking, and he's a six foot eight lineman you just can't beat that size right there man for around 6k you should go ahead and pick him up if you need a left tackle on your team now to the left guards rob sims from the lions six foot three once again i'm sticking with the size theme here 90 strength 90 awareness 87 pass blocking 80 impact blocking goes for around 5k uh, not the best card but at the same time not bad at all if you're just starting out much you should go ahead and pick this card up you know, save 5K, go ahead, scoop them up. It's that easy. Next up, we have Brian De La Puente. <laughs> Amazing name right there. Six foot three, 87 strength, 85 awareness, 90 pass blocking, 78 run blocking, not the best, but that impact block, that's what really puts him over the edge. When I was looking at this card, I had to compare him to my center. Uh, after this video, I think I went ahead and did some solos, got enough coins to scoop him up because he was just that good, man. I think he's going to elevate my... Oh, and there we go. Look, as, just as I was doing this video, someone went and bought him because that was just a great price for this card. He was going for around 5K. Everything else was around like 8 or 9K. So when I saw him, I was like, this is such a steal. And that's what happened. Now to the right card, John Asamoa. I scooped him up, I think, on the first day of Mutt. And yeah, look at his stats, man. I had to compare him. I already have him on my team. Just to show you guys how good he is, I went a little bit in depth. 88 pass block, 86 run blocking. And we're going to go even more in depth at the impact blocking, 85. Just above average for all these stats, all these in depth stats. His best one's a pass block footwork. He can do the run block. Man, he's just an all around great lineman. Go ahead and pick him up if you see him under 10K. 
And now we have Justin Pooh, last but not least, six foot four from the Giants of all teams, but the 87 pass block, 84 run block, and a 91 impact blocking. So that will wrap up this budget squad video. Leave a like if you enjoyed it and you saw any cards that you might be picking up in the future. Subscribe if you're new. We have another one coming out on the defensive players. 